<laughs> That's some fine work. Ah. I might be able to disable security from here. We have a bit of a weird episode here. There aren't going to be any fights or strong story moments. We're mostly just going to be climbing stairs. Now, this was a scene in the original game. You could either bust in the front of the Shinra Tower, or you could sneak in the back way and climb up the stairs. In this case, we're going in the front door, but still climbing the stairs. But there aren't any fights. What's that about? You have got to be shitting me. Nope. We're a lot less likely to get caught this way. But a lot more likely to die of boredom. It's only 59 floors. Nothing to it. Well, at least it ain't a race. Small blessing. This doesn't really make any sense to me because... I mean, why couldn't you use an elevator? Because, oh, no, they'll see you if you take an elevator. You tell me there aren't any security cameras in the stairs? Wonder what it's like up there. More security and restrictions. It's not going to get any easier. We're going to be exhausted by the time we finally get to the top. As long as you pace yourself, you'll be fine. Maybe we should take a quick break. Come on, Barrett. It's going to be an awkward one. There's a lot of dialogue I got to cut in and out of so let's give it a shot you can stop if you want you can even say it's for me just say you can't hack it i'll hack you jackass oh that's enough from both of you stupid arguments aren't gonna get us there faster but tifa i wasn't not now save it for the top i do think it's a little bit funny here that the characters are arguing a little bit and they did a little bit in the original game, too. They argued on the way up because it was a frustrating thing to have to climb all the stairs. Hey, wait up. It's a funny thing in the original game because it was the only moment in which Tifa came across in any way mean in the entire game. I guess these labs and shit are all the way at the very top. Yep. The very top. That's good to know. Cloud, keep an eye on Barrett. Copy. What was that? I don't think I heard you. Speak up. I'll keep an eye on Barrett. <sighs> Thanks for the assist. I don't know if you ever climbed a hundred flights of stairs before, but it is kind of rough. But then again, these are superhumans that are capable of jumping 30 feet in the air. So, what are they bitching about here? I said, wait up! If I were making this game, I probably would have made this scene optional, like in the original game. Because forcing a person to just push the stick left, forward, left, forward a bunch of times is a bit boring. Just a few floors behind you. <laughs> oh? <laughs> You're sounding better. Yeah. Think I've got, like, a stair climber's high. <laughs> Glad to hear it. Jeez, 32 floors. <laughs> I said, wait up! You tired? I was, but I'm feeling okay now. What are we waiting for? Let's roll! You really are doing better. We, we gotta keep moving. <laughs> to keep moving. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> Hard to argue with that. Let's go. As you get higher, the um, characters slow down. So Cloud is just walking at this point. And I'm like, okay. It makes, makes the whole section of the game take longer. 
especially since the original game just sort of ran the entire time. Of course, he's going to get tired. How the hell did Barrett catch up with him? Barrett's a big fella. This should have been hardest on him. But tell me, these stairs, are these stairs ever going to end? I don't think the stairs are talking. Well, duh. I mean... Duh. I was joking. That's enough from both of you. In the original game, Cloud didn't slow down at all. He ran at full speed the entire time. And it was the other two characters, Barrett and Tifa, that were complaining about being tired and all that. Of course, I guess it makes sense since Cloud was like the... supposed to be the super elite soldier. Uh, it would make sense he was most fit of the group. But in this say, I think Tifa actually makes it to the stop the top of the stairs first. Worst route ever. Give me a suicidal last day. At least at least at least that'd have it in. Ah, uh, just listening to the characters talk is I guess the entire thing for being here, but the fact that they're so distant makes them a little bit difficult to hear. They probably should have uh, jacked up their volume a little bit. Yep, and you're in no state to fight anyway. So, what should I do? The fact that this was an optional thing in the original game is kind of an important thing for how well it works. It's an extra scene that you can see the second time you played through the game, and you did have some options. You can bust in through the front door, and you can fight your way through. You can have that experience. Then you can have this much more boring experience with a number of stairs you gotta climb, you get to see some extra character dialogue. But if you know it's there and you're aware of the choice, you can make the decision of whether you want to have that run up the stairs thing, or you want to bust in through the front door. And this I don't know, the beginning of this dungeon is dragging a bit. You had the Tifa swinging across the chandelier thing. Which I guess works well enough as a scene on its own. But does go on for a little bit too long. It's not true platforming because you don't have full control of the character as you're doing it. You're more or less moving on a rail. And then you have this scene where there isn't any combat, there isn't any action but climbing the stairs. I probably wouldn't have had these two scenes occur one after another. I get that you want to have some scenes that are slower than others for the sake of preserving energy, but don't bond line them up one after the other. Another day, another struggle. Climbing stairs, so much trouble. Cloud, slow down. This is another little bit of an irritation that Barrett is going to progress up the stairs at the speed he's going to. And Cloud's going to get up there as fast as you can get him up there. So I climb these stairs and I'm stuck waiting for 24, 25 seconds or so before Barrett actually shows up to join. Oh, he just sort of appears. And then <laughs> he just sort of stands there and breathes heavy before the scene continues. Whatever, it's over. Made it. The real challenge starts now. Okay, let's go. 